Oh, hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Kotar 2! Oh god! And uh, yeah, we're in a fight with Atris and she's kicking our butts, so I'm gonna level up to restore my health. Uh, okay. Doesn't matter what we get, come on. I can level up again. Oh, that's good, that's good, okay. Damn, dude, this is stupid! I can't- OH MY GOD! A 117? Alright, let's level up again. <laughs> it's like a cheat. Alright, uh, I'll get up my strength. Good, I can level up again. Leave me alone, you beast! God, what am I gonna do? Oh my- Should I just run for it? Run for it. Oh no, the door. Oh god. Fuck it. You swine! She's just too powerful. She's just way too powerful, guys. This is obscene. Okay, I gave myself something that... Uh, an implant. It, re it, it uh... Immunes me to horror and things like that, so she can't use that anymore. Ew, look at her face. It's kind of weird from this angle. It's like, wow. It's the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, dude. She's coming for me. Oh, God. Leave me alone! Oh, God, 103. Alright, we're leveling again. This is really like a cheat right now. I think that's why I can't beat her though, because I'm so low level. But I'm doing some damage. You prick! Uh, ow. Leave me alone! What have I ever done to you? Besides killed all your apprentices. Alright, 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 hold on. Eh. What the hell? Alright, we're leveling again. Alright, well, we finally got Flurry on her, so maybe it'll come in handy. Eh. You know it'll work. I should equip, like, a really good shield. Uh, do I have a Verpine? I do. Alright, screw it, I'm using it. This will teach you. Ow. Alright, now let's level up again. Full health. Let's go, Atrus, you fricker! Oh! Poison! God, alright, we'll use a... a damn... Anido kit. What the hell, why can't I use it? It's not letting me use it! Alright, whatever. Didn't last that long anyway. I'm right, gonna prototype shield it up again. Eh. Gonna level again. Eh. Attributes. Yeah, dex stick. No, constitution. Eh. Oh god. Uh. Oh Jesus. Oh, Jesus! I don't have any more level ups either, guys, so... This is it after this. Oh, God, 90? 90, really? Was 90 necessary? Oh, God. I'm the battle of my life. Or of her life. Gotta verpine it up again. Stop healing yourself, you cheater! Fine, then I'll just heal myself. Uh, life support pack, all day, what the hell? Oh yeah, I'm the only one here. Oh, sorry. No, stop! Uh, what if I'm not supposed to win? What if, like, she's supposed to beat me, and I'm just wasting all my fucking Verpine shield and, and repair medkits? You know, I think that's the case. I'm gonna let her beat me and see what happens. We fought valiantly, though. Yep, I know it. Damn. Enough. Oh God! Did you have feelings for him? Did you touch him? Did you look upon him with love? Oh. There is no love in that one. He is a shell, devoid of emotion. All that he was died at Malakor, and he dies there still, as he should. What's going on here? One exile has arrived to save another. 
You have truly fallen far to kill a helpless opponent. It is no crime to kill the Sith, or any that threaten the Republic, as you proved in the Mandalorian Wars. This is now my battle, and you are now my enemy. Where is Kreia, Atris? Kreia? Uh, that is not her name. She is gone, and is now beyond your reach, Exile. Where she has gone, only I shall follow. After I have dealt with you. Surrender, Atris. I don't want to fight you. Such a noble offer. Your execution has been too long delayed, Exile. <gasps> Handmaiden! Oh man, I mean, she was a bitch and all, but she didn't deserve to die like that! Alright, Verpine shield up. Let's go, you. Oh no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. We gotta buff a little more. Force Enlightenment! What's up? You're gonna pay, Atris. Hey, hey, over here. Over. Oh, no, you don't. You're not healing again. I got the dark side powers, too. Oh, so you want a death field battle, do you? <laughs> Wait, if I force immune myself, she won't be able to uh, do it. What the hell? Sorry. <laughs> All right, let's finish her off with the force lightning. Bye bye. That's right. Run. Wait a minute. Get back here. All right, I'm fully like buffing myself now. All right. Yeah, she might have been a bitch to me at the end, but. I hope she's all right, handmaiden. She said you would come here to this place. If you think you can defeat me here, you are wrong. All this collected knowledge, all these teachings of combat and the Force, they're mine to command. And if I must use it to end you, I will. Surrender. You need not die. You have fallen to the dark side, Atris. Surely you see that. Atris? That is not who I am. Not any longer. She has not existed for some time, I think. There was always something else within me. It just took time for its voice to be heard. Atrus, we, we don't have time for this. We, we need to unite if we're to stop the Sith. Yes, the Sith are here at last. You have brought them to this place as I had foreseen. It has all been part of my plans for you. And when I defeat you and the forces you have brought to Telos, I shall take the battle to the heart of the Sith and wipe them out forever. Where is the Sith base? I do not know. Yet. But it does not matter. They have come here to face the Republic in battle, and they will be destroyed. You have placed everyone on Citadel Station in jeopardy, Atrus. Yes. The Sith are here at last. You have brought them to this place as I had foreseen. It has all been part of my plans for you. And when I defeat you and the forces you have brought to Telos, I shall take the battle to the heart of the Sith and wipe them out. Forever. She's crazy. She's just repeating herself at this point. What plans are you talking about? These Sith are cowards, striking from the shadows to kill Jedi. I needed a target to draw them out, but I could not risk my own life, all that remained of the Jedi. So I arranged for you to return to the Republic, leaked information of your past, and then waited for the Sith to come. And they did. But you came to Telos against my predictions. Now they are here, I can finally face this enemy and defeat them. Oh, this manipulative... What happened to you? The old woman you traveled with finally made me listen to myself. To the galaxy. She said that you would come here, and that you would face me in battle. There is no reason for us to fight. She said you were the last obstacle to my enlightenment. If I wished to truly face the Sith to see their heart, then that meant facing you, this last time. Where did she go? I do not know, yet. I suspect she went in search of you. But just as when she first came here, her path is difficult to see. She has set many things in motion. It is she that ordered the extermination of all Jedi so long ago. She will answer for her crimes. What? In time. She is Sith, just as you are, just as all who followed Revan were. What? I will not fight you. Surrender and 
And I will spare you. Surrender to you. Never. Let us end this. Oh god, and now I'm all debuffed too? Oh, we better... Oh jeez. Oh god. Force immunity. That's all I need is immunity. Alright, bitch. Alright. Oh. Oh, what's up? I'll lightsaber fighter for a little bit. This will teach you. Oh, Jesus! And why does she sound like Handmaiden right there? Ah. Dude. What the hell? I was force immune. This is bullshit. Ah. Get away from me. You cheater. I'm like force immune. You can still do stuff to me. What is that? What is that bullshit? Alright, Atrus. I'm getting sick of your shit. It's time you beat it. Stop it! Oh. So, uh, yeah, good old Death Field will finish her off. Boop! Kill me. End this. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna kill her. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. We gotta stay on the light path here, guys. We gotta. I will not kill a helpless opponent, Atrus. I did not expect mercy from you. Here, at the end. After all that has happened between us. We have greater problems, Atrus. Alright? And there and there's been enough killing. The, the fuck? If you will not kill me, then what will you do? Oh, is that? Um. Can you tell me where the Sith are striking from? The fuck? You always knew where they were striking from. You always knew. These Sith are spawned of you. Spawned by the Mandalorian Wars. All those deaths. All those Jedi. Their power is to feed on life. Until nothing is left except a hollow galaxy. Echoing with the screams of the Jedi lost to us. Is that where Kreia has gone? Yes. I had thought she was awaiting me at that place, but I see now that she lied. It was not meant for me, but for you. She has gone there. She is waiting for you to travel to Malachor 5, to finish what you started. What I started? Malachor 5? I've heard enough. This matter is finished. And what will you do with me now? Abandon me here on this dead world? Or end my life as I wish to end yours? I will do nothing, except tell you that I am sorry. I did not realize that the Mandalorian Wars would hurt others that I that had known me and cared for me. It does not matter. Not now. It is what I did with such pain that caused the wound. But I thank you. Damn it! Shut the fuck up! Leave now, while you can. Save Telos. Save the galaxy. Save yourself. Shut up, jeez! I thought I had lost you. What? Well, I was a little late, but better late than never. Kreia. She said the council had ended you. And all along, she was one of those who had sought to kill us. Both carry their truth in a way. When I heard her say that you were dead, I... I failed you. I let my emotion run through me and I acted without thinking. I wanted to punish her. Hurt her. See her answer for what she had done to the Jedi for leading you to the Council. It is alright. Don't dwell on it. We will take action all in its proper time. Of course. Uh, forgive my display. I... I am the last of the Handmaidens no longer. I am Brianna, Disciple of the last of the Jedi. And the one who will stand with you against all enemies who face us. Name's Brianna, huh? That's interesting. Well, uh, then let's get to it. We've got a planet to save. Oh, shit. It's the Ravenger. You know who's on board. Oh, no. This ain't looking good. Well, what do we have here? I didn't believe it when Linu reported the Ebon Hawk at dock, but I guess it really has. Though given the trouble we've been having, maybe I shouldn't be surprised to see you. What? What's going on? 
Oh no! Lieutenant Gren, Sith forces have breached the module what? and are attempting to pen us up in the compound. Damn. Saron, I need you and your men to break through and lead the assault. With pleasure, Lieutenant. All right, follow me. Awesome, our buddies from Kunda are here, man. So how did this happen? It came out of nowhere. A fleet of warships dropped out of hyperspace, and before we could scramble fighters to intercept them, we were under attack. There were Sith fighters everywhere. And the few flights we sent out were barely launched when the bombardment began. We did our best, but we couldn't stop the landing craft that followed the initial wave. We couldn't hold back the Sith troops. We chose to retreat and began the evacuation instead. Then there's also the fuel situation. Yeah, right. No fuel from Paragus, I know. Because we don't have enough fuel, we won't be able to keep the station in orbit and operational and fight off the Sith at the same time. We'll try to make the best of what we have left, but it's going to be cutting it pretty close. The Sith numbers seem limitless, but we haven't lost all hope. We've heard reports that we might be receiving some assistance. Have you heard any word of uh, the reinforcements? We need to get to the Ravager. If you need to get to the Ravager, then you're going to have to fight your way to the shuttle from here to the entertainment module, then make your way to the docking shuttle. Good luck. Crazy shit, man. Hey, Adam's with us. Nice. <sighs> Jeez, it's, it's begun. Hey, look, it's Mandalore. Over there. Well, anyway, so yeah, I'm going to cut it here, guys. This has been a short episode, I guess, but, you know, big crazy battle with Atrus. So, in the next episode, we'll go through, uh... A Citadel station here and try our best to fucking kick all the Sith's ass as always. So, until then, everybody, this has been Ragerbox, and I'll catch you next time. Later.